Here at Carthage College, everybody has access to the digital version of the Wall Street Journal. To create your account to have access, from the Carthage homepage, go up to Tools, down to One Login. And for me, I see the Wall Street Journal icon under the Frequents tab. But if you don't see it here, go ahead and just click on Carthage All Apps and it should appear there. So to create your account, go ahead and click on it. Choose the account type. And in this case, for a student, you'll have to choose graduation month and year. You have to put in a unique password. This doesn't need to be tied to your Carthage password at all. This allows you the benefit of, of logging in outside of one login. I would uncheck the box that says to receive updates and special offers but you do have to agree to their privacy policy. Then go ahead and click on Create. Once you click Create, you're gonna get a confirmation message. So when you, when you create your account, it's gonna ask you a bunch of, of questions and you can decide do you wanna answer them or not. I generally go ahead and skip all of them. Now that you're logged in, I'm just gonna point out a few things. So at the very top, you're gonna to see categories such as home, world, US, politics, et cetera. And these are the same kind of categories that you'd find in the print edition. If you actually wanted to read the print edition as it appears in paper, go ahead and click on print edition right here. And then click on read WSJ print edition. You can also put the app on your, if you have a tablet, if you have an iPad or a phone, you can go ahead and put the app on. And that's when you would log in you know, using your Carthage email address and whatever that personal password that you created when you created your Wall Street Journal account. All right, the last thing that I'll point out is if I click on my name at the top right here, you know, this is where I have access to a few other things and I can control my account. But I always like to point out WSJ Plus. And WSJ Plus is part of the Wall Street Journal that um, if you like getting access to free ebooks or audiobooks, they do give you um, a choice of, of three or four things about once every every couple months. And so, you know, if you want a free ebook or a free audiobook and it looks attractive to you, um, you know, go ahead and, and make sure that you sign up for WSJ Plus as well. That's how you get access to the Wall Street Journal. Thank you and have a great day.